Hi ladies, this is Marishi and my channel Shaloka. Let's see what is your situation as of now and what you need to hear from me. Aries out there, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. What is it that you need to hear from me? Just one more time. All right. Aries out there. Your first card is this one, which is a wish card. Something which you wish for is coming through. It is happening real quick. Okay? A dream of yours is coming through. And I feel like you are in control of the, over the situation. It's just happening out of the blue. Like, you know, a sudden shift is happening. Some of you might be dealing with an Aquarius or probably a Leo. This could be a person as well. Okay. I want to say some of you are getting a breakthrough. Now, something which you wanted, something which you wished for is happening just like that. Okay. Without um, you expecting it. Aries, what is your next card? See, just like I said, you are in control. And it's it's almost like it's about time. It's about time. You deserve this. That's why it's coming through. This is something which you really wanted. Some of you might be dealing with a Capricorn, a Cancerian, or probably a Libra. Okay? Ooh, it broke. Yes. And I felt like uh, with that four of pentacles and the fire swords, you never give up. There is something which um, felt like it's never going to happen. But then I don't see you giving up. You kept fighting for it. Even if, uh, if it felt like it's a lost battle, you never give up. You held on to this dream of yours. Whatever it is about, you held on to it. And now it, it seems like the shift is happening. It is happening. Okay. What else? Aries out there. What is your next card, please? Your next card is High Priestess. It's almost like uh, you knew it will eventually come through. Yes. With that Knight of Cups, you knew it will come through. That is why you never gave up. You felt it, that it will eventually happen. Okay, whatever that dream of yours, you held on to it because you always knew within that it's worth it. What the fight. Even though people, okay, might not have been on the same page, you never gave up on this. Some of you might be dealing with an Aquarius or a Pisces or a Cancerian. Moving on. Aries out there. What is your next card, please? This one. The card in the center of your reading is the wheel. The wheel is finally turning in your favor. Okay? Things are happening. Uh, earlier, there were conflicts. Okay? Five points. It wasn't easy. Like I said, people were not on the same page as you. But now, things are moving in your favor. How you wanted it, whatever you wished for, whatever you waited for, is finally coming through. All right? Moving on, Aries, what is your next card, please? What is your next card, please? Justice is being served. It is meant to happen. It is supposed to happen. And you knew it. That is why you kept, you know, fighting for this. You kept waiting for this to come through. Because you believed in this. Yes. Um, 
some of you might have been waiting for a person to come through there might have been uh, so much conflicts between the two of you but you never gave up now this person might be coming through or it could be something which you really wanted it could be some kind of uh, uh, you know something with you know uh, with a strong foundation it could be a work situation it could be a business situation whatever it is it is coming through some of you might be even getting married with that knight of cups coming through this person might be coming back to make it official with you or it could be a job opportunity from a big organization and it's almost like if there was delays things are turning around okay some of you might be dealing with a Libran or a Taurus one last card for the Aries out there I also want to say uh, there is some kind of expansion, you know, your horizons are opening up with whatever is coming your way. Okay, whatever that star card is about, you know, um, things are just expanding for you. You know, there is, when I spoke about the shift, when this shift happens, you know, there is so much for you out there. Like things are just being laid out for you if that makes sense yes with that six of wands yeah you know, it's it's a path is opening up for you you are on the path of victory success some of you might be dealing with a leo very nice all right aries one last card for the aries out there See, uh, this is your last card. And I also want to say with this, things weren't okay. Like, yeah. Um, there is also a warning in here. There might be some kind of an offer which is coming through which is not exactly what it what you expected some reason you're like uh this is not what i wanted it could be a person as well you you're not all that interested this is not the person of your dreams but then it could be camouflaged somehow it could be um packaged differently okay you, you, when this person is coming with the cup this person has to offer you something, right? But the way you are sitting up out there is like, no, oh, thank you. Not, not really interested. But, because the cup which is being offered is not exactly what you wanted for some reason. But uh, what they're trying to say is, whatever is being offered might seem initially that it's not what you wanted. But it has loads of potential with that Ace of Pentacles. It is worth it. Okay. This is coming to you. Because you deserve it. You might not know yet. Know it yet. Okay. When it's presented to you. You might not realize it. But give it a shot. And see where it takes you. No. Yeah how it turns out to be and you will realize it has loads of potential okay there is something about uh, disappointments this could uh, could be from the past as well. You might have had disappointments with the situation or the person previously. That is why you are not all that keen on accepting it. But whatever they has to offer, yeah, might bring about a great deal of difference. Yeah, it's, it's just taking you to the next level. With that Knight of Cups and the Wheel of Fortune. It could also be right now you are focused on what has been lost, what did not work out, 
not happy with how things are in your life, uh, it will take you out of this. Okay, whatever is coming your way will take you out of that phase of your life. Okay, I'm going to stop here. I wish you luck. If any of this makes sense, let me know. That's it for now. This is Marishi. You're my channel, Shiloka. Until next time, bye.